Hi friends, this is Vetrigal. This tutorial I will teach uh, create a crystal report uh, and uh, build a crystal report using the SQL statement. So just I am click go to add new item. So SQL statement means you have to write the query in, in SQL queries inside here uh, report only. So just I am going to select a report and select the special report in special report. I am changing the name to SQL command dot rpt and just click enter. So we will get I am choosing blank report and click OK. Okay guys, this is here there and put a success, no need for that. I already explained uh, how, how report header is working and how page header is working like that. So here I need to add a database. So right click database export. Inside database export, I am going to um, create a new connection in OLDB. Here just I am adding provider. I am entering to server name. I uh, have to enter the select the server name or else you have to put the dot here. Uh, okay. Uh, and just I am selecting the my database test DB and click next and finish. So once finished, this is my database. Uh, test db this is my table dbo dbo is database owner i have the three tables table one table two and table three right now i need to add a command so here add command is there so you have to just double click here mm, so here i am writing the sql queries so okay by trading purpose i am just going to my project one more time uh, or else I am just going to view and server is server explore here my database is the uh, test db test db database is the so inside a test db database uh, table also is the three tables is the uh, table name table one table two table three right click the table and click new query and select the table one so I need all the fields so that's why I am selecting all the fields here in set okay so I am so I am selected all the fields and I am trying to execute the records this is my records so four rows is there four rows and five columns is there so before that what, what I am do just and copy the table name control C here just I am pasting the table name control V dot so the uh, crystal report accept only field names uh, before that your table name then only so I am changing like that table name control C and just dot age control V dot salary control V dot and then incentive control v dot so just i am copy those things copy now i am moving to crystal report here just i paste it so this is my query just i click ok so my command is here is that so we need to change the name for this command just click here double click here here option is there here to change your name so what the name I'm putting just I'm putting table tables that's it so just I'm click OK so we get the tables here tables columns also is comes it comes here just I'm tracking down to table ID username age salary and then incentive 
so i'm just going to the here so one more thing is you have to put those things into your what detail section then only it will be detailed okay so i'm getting the data also so now what i'm do i need so you have to see uh, i am putting the text field here to id so by designing purpose i am pa pass the recording once i designed after that i am viewing okay so guys now i am designed id name age salary and incentive so you have to go to designing view you have to get like that so i am just i am formatting the fields I right click format multiple numbers i'm selecting this field is okay now i'm just giving the purpose so we didn't get any uh, decimal files here so what i'm do uh, i need one more field uh, that's called salary plus incentive so i need to add salary plus incentive so what i'm do normally i'm using the formula field here so going to formula field and uh, add salary plus incentive so we are using the sql command you know? so that's why we have to change sql command for the query also so just go to data expert one once again and click the tables and right click edit command inside the edit command i am using just copy those things control c comma control v here i'm just plus so i need column name so as column name as what is s a l underscore i an incentive so i am changing the name like that just click okay and click okay now you have to go to the field i am getting one more column is salary plus incentive so just i am track down to salary plus incentive here i am changing the formatting field edit object i am just total i am putting T O T A L total like that, and after that I'm going to just format object font. I'm choosing bold and for edit. Sorry, format object. I'm going to font just underline take the underline and click OK. I need like. Just expanding the field like that. So I need once again expanding the report also, the line also, and I'm putting go to toolbox and line and just track down the report. Sorry, delete any. So now going to, so it will add it. 5000 plus 100 equal to 5100, 10,000 plus uh, 568 equal to 10,568. So added. So here no need to write the code. You have the, you have to know the SQL query very well. Then you have to create the command option. Command, command again. Then you uh, you will get those things also. Once again, I am doing what I am doing. Uh, uh, this is okay. We get incentive and total. So I am just formatting the field, format object, and select those things. So what I am do? I need the parameter. So so this SQL command. I need to create the parameter also. So we have getting the four records. So I am going to uh, once again in a field explorer in field explorer and just selecting the database expert in database expert and click edit command so i am here parameter list is there so i need to create the parameter list so that's why 
where here create parameter parameter mean uh, input id promoter text i know need to promoter text id is uh, integer or string i don't know just i'm going to verify those things as is integer or just to open data with definition so it is integer okay so now I am going to report field. I am selecting two number. So default value I am putting no need to default value. So just click OK. So here I am writing uh, just I am writing where ID. So ID is table one I read table one dot id equal to id id I think it's okay. So some error is there. So boolean opens and rows set okay option is there. So so what I'm do I need to add this parameter. So just I know one close and question mark where is the question mark here question mark id and close. I think it's right and click OK so it asking the uh, default value i'm putting just one and click ok so and click ok so parameter default parameter also added and the table also is there so i'm just viewing the report so getting the those one value default value to and click the repress it will be asking so i'm putting two and click ok so two and click sorry repress and putting three and get it so like that we have to using the parameter also so okay guys we will uh, meet our next tutorial in best way i will teach okay